Well, hello, and welcome back to Dark Souls, where I am getting um, a training lesson in PvP in this game. And we've been, well, I did a little bit of dancing with Sif in the last video. Pretty awesome boss, kind of like most of the bosses in this game. Lava ahead. Okay. I don't know where, but I'll give you humanity. Yeah. I, I, I just cannot, like, state enough how much I love the boss fights in this game. Again, I'm going to continue to say it. They are simply awesome. They got big bosses down pretty good. Which is, um, which is, uh, it's awesome. It's nice. Again, reminds me of Shadow of the Colossus, some of these bosses do. Just they're, um, not nearly as giant, obviously, since you're not climbing up them and everything, but there we go, invading. Yep. Let's see if I can invade. There we go. I was going to say, let's see if we can start the invasion before those two things kill me. Okay. Is somebody killing my friends over here? Conscripsy. I am coming for you, wherever you are. Mm -hmm. It would be nice if there were some other phantoms around here with me, too. I wonder if he is hunting me right now. I have no doubt that he got a message. Here. Okay. We know that the dance is on, then. Let's see if I can parry him. Probably not. Crap, he actually hit me there? Yeah, I did. I could have taken him, dang it. <laughs> oh. That was my fight to win, and I ended up losing it. I'm gonna lose... I'm probably gonna lose a handful more. And then... Then the winning will start. And then once the winning starts, the losing will start... Back again. I need to get used to, like, disengaging myself from combat. For some reason, it just feels... It feels immoral to me to just break combat and step back to heal. But I should. I should do it. That's why I have my fucking flasks. So that I don't have to just sit there and die. I could use magic. I don't just have to stab. I gotta, gotta talk myself into how to do this. It's going to be a... It's going to be a... Yeah, it's going to be a horrible um, next few videos until I get this. Come back here, you bastard. I am missing my Grass Crest shield. I didn't think it made that much of a difference in stamina recovery, but uh, I am feeling it. In my mind, at least. And that's the only place it really matters. There it goes, cycling again. What are you doing? Quit that. Now. Bastards. I still haven't restarted since the last video. Not, not that I know it would help or anything, but it's just really weird. No, quit that. Quit it. Quit it. Quit it right now. It might also be my USB um, ports screwing up. I've had issues with my USB. Quit it. Quit fucking cycling. Why the fuck do you want to be on purple moss? I'm going to get frustrated here. Yeah. Because again, if it starts doing that when I'm in the middle of combat, I will be exceptionally angry. Try close ranged battle. Yeah. Eminent sorrow. Good lord. Hey, Sif. Are you the one hacking my controller here? <laughs> it is still cycling. I don't understand it. 
kind of want to die just so I can reset this damn thing. Cheater. Out of bounds. It's a do-over. I can't heal. <laughs> it's my fucking flasks. There we go. Good lord. You know what? Hang on. Can I run? I just want to go get the item back here because I'm going to die. I don't think I can win this. A hornet ring. Especially with my items burgin' out over there. Get my souls. I'll jump your sword. Yeah. I would love to have it on my flasks. There we go. No, Sif, time out. Yeah, awesome. I'm on my fucking fist. God damn it. I wanted my sword there. I'm gonna take a drink here, whatever. If I die, so be it. I've already consigned myself to death. Okay. No. Bad dog. Yes. Okay, that's a little bit better. A little bit more like it. My shit has stopped freaking out over there. Yeah, I dove right into that one. I didn't see what... I didn't actually think about which side he was coming from. I'll drink to that. Or not. Okay. I have to drink any time I think that I can. God damn it. Clump telegraphing your attacks. That's why he's able to do that. So I can be in mid-swing and then he just rips it out. God damn it. Come on, stamina. I don't know why I am not doing my lunge attack. There we go. That's what I've been wanting to do. Fancy. But... I'm just going to have to do slashes, because thrusting is not reliable enough. I've wasted too much stamina trying to do that. Wow. Did not block that at all. A toast for your health. God dang it. Okay, I, I can still do this. I can still kill you. Or not. Because I wanted to nurse the bottle. Yeah. I can kill this dog if I'll quit fucking around and if my controls will quit freaking out. <laughs> I don't I don't know what the hell's going on. It's the night of the curse. Okay. I'm not going to restart yet, because I'll have to pause the video, and I'm simply too lazy for that. I'm just going to continue to bitch until this video's over with. And then I'll bitch some more in the next video if it keeps happening after I restart. Lava ahead. Need wings? Have humanity, sir. Because that is all I have. Here, there you go. And how did you die? Roll off the edge? That is what happens whenever you play in the forest drunk. Somebody doing PvP there? I don't know. There's so much action in the forest, it's just unbelievable. If you get kills, um, you can go talk to Alvina. And... Hey, who are you? Okay. Lava? Apparently lava is another meme or something. There's so many different memes that go around for this game. Like that skeleton one. If you, There we go, we're invading. If you ever want easy humanity, try to catch on and latch on to one of those memes. 
I've seen some of those memes upvoted to 30, 40 plus on my Pyromancer that I'm playing. I think one of the ones on that I recorded even on here was like 20 plus or something. More humanity than I've ever had active. Okay. Where you at, Hornet? More importantly, how badass are you? Are you another person who's going to stomp me down in one hit? Teach me some humility? That's what, the, that's what this video and the last video has been. Awesome. So they're not over here. If you really want to, you can try to pull the enemy into... Um, the region of these NPCs, and the NPCs will help you kill them. Okay, I don't see anybody yet. I see a ghost. Come here, ghost. You ghast. You geest. Uh, you know, if a player was really smart, they might even be able to just stand still and confuse me. I would think they were an NPC, because I wouldn't know better. Where are you? They can be pretty much anywhere in this big forest. Shh. You might be able to hear their footsteps. If you listen close enough. Hey, are these guys... Hey, they'll actually help me here. They won't attack me. So, they're not over here. I wonder where they're at. They must have just entered the forest because there's nothing dead. So... Possible that they could be over here? I don't know if this... It's got to count as part of the forest, otherwise it would be sealed off. By the white light. I think. Where are you? Yeah, so... They probably... They might have come through here. Somebody sent me a message? What? Near the mushrooms. Okay. Interesting. I had forgot that uh, Xbox Live worked that way. So I wonder what they're doing over here. Chilling with the shrooms. Okay. I heard footsteps. I didn't know... If it was him or not. And this is a pretty nice way to explore the area. There he is. We'll get away from the shrooms. That way there's no interference. Point to him. He's got... Is that Latrax armor? I would bow if I could. I don't think I have that... That gesture. I wonder if I could parry him. I'm gonna try. Going for the backstab. Oh, wow. I just got bitch slapped. Again, powerful hits. Yeah, he's got, um... I think that guy's name was Latrec? Larec? Le Maybe Larec. That guy that I freed from prison, he's got his armor on. Interesting. I was curious if you could get that armor. I think you can wear any armor in the game. Like, any armor that any NPC has, you can get if you kill them. And take it off their still warm corpse. And steal their humanity, too. So. I've only had one person 
I've only fought one person that I think I could have beat, and I had to ruin it by um, being completely stupid. He was still dressed in his low-level pyromancer gear. I kind of felt bad for him. Be wary of fatty. Yeah, I'm not going into the tomb. Interesting. I will take that extra flask. Okay. I don't know exactly why I got an extra flask. Uh, somebody said something that you occasionally get them if somebody kindles the same bonfire that you are uh, marked at, but... I don't know. Oh, and it's this guy again. Okay, and I'm guessing he's probably all the way back over by the mushrooms. Interesting. Generally, I heard, I read that it tries to put you close to the person. But... This put me just about as far away as possible from him. Which sucks. Maybe we can meet, like, on the bridge or something. There's only three or four locations you can actually spawn at as a forest invader. And we might have seen them all already. Yep, he's up there fighting still. It's cute how I uh, can see those damage bars. So... I think a good, you know, again, I like that everybody's been fairly polite, been bowing before and after the fights and everything. I like that. No teabagging. Thankfully, I don't think that's... Is he behind me? No, it's those damn mushrooms. There he is. see. Let's see if he sees me bow. There we go. And another flask. Awesome. I wonder, I'm, I'm really going to try to parry this stuff here. Yeah, not dual parrying. I nicked him, which doesn't say much. Yeah, he wants that delicious backstab. Don't we all? I wonder if those mushrooms, they must not be, um... There we go. Those mushrooms must not be that, um... Violent. I got a little bit of a lag stab there. Oh, yes. Oh, shit. Oh, damn, he's got, um, pretty good fire resist, I think. Oh, <laughs> so close. <laughs> Almost had him. That was a good fight. Oh, I was really hoping that my, um, pyromancy was gonna do more damage than that. Hopefully that was a little bit un like a little bit surprising for him there. That's kind of what I want with my character build. I want, you know, I want to have lots of utility. Like I can have a really powerful sword, not maybe not as powerful enough to kill in one or two hits, but I want to be quick, be able to sting, be able to maybe drop some heals on myself with magic or uh, different other types of buffs. There's a ton of different spells and everything. And I don't know most of them. Because I am still very much a, uh, a novice at this game. But yes. I like this. I, and again, you can wear this ring anywhere. You don't have to set in the forest. So if I ever get bored while we're out um, getting our asses kicked by the bosses, I can put the ring on and we can get our asses kicked uh, by people for a while. It is the Prepare to Die edition. So, 
I've warned you guys of that whenever I first started recording this. Do not expect Plump to be a winner. I am uh, I'm the dude who always dies, apparently. <laughs> I am the token LP here. So, I'm not going to go to Sif just yet, by the way. Because I think that Sif can still probably kill me. I still haven't reset, and I don't feel like fighting the son of a bitch right now. I do want to explore the rest of this forest, and... Why are you mushroom guys so cute? And so nice. It's just unbelievable. They're not plump helmets, because they're not purple, but... They're still in the Myconid family, and that's all that matters. Anything down there? I wonder what he's doing over here. Is he farming those mushrooms or what? Maybe there's a bonfire over here? Yeah, we're invading again. <clears throat> this will probably be the last invasion before I end the video. It's close enough to 30 minutes. And... Nitrous. Who was Nitrous? Was Nitrous that guy that I, um... Was he the one that I almost killed? Or should have been able to kill? Or... Hey, there's another forest invader here. Okay. I'm just going to kind of stay back. Primarily because I don't want to end up stabbing... my brother there. But... Hell. I guess he's just going to backstab us straight to hell. Well... That's what happens. My uh, other phantom kind of actually looked like me. It looked like he had the same robes and everything. Interesting. I'm not going to end the video just yet. I thought that that was going to take a little bit longer. But it did not. That guy, I bet you he's been playing all night long just farming invaders. Here. I'd be curious to know what level he is. Need humanity? There you go. My dear friend, you might be my enemy in the forest, but hey, have some humanity. And we'll see if we can run back to where those mushrooms were real quick. Nope. This will be the last invasion. <clears throat> Let's hope it's a good one. I would love to end this two-part PvP series on a high note for once. You know, yeah, I need to look at, um, Sif's ring. Okay. Arise, my forest dwellers. BNY Pro. There is... There he is up there. He's already being engaged by a, uh, a phantom. And I'm not going to give him the benefit of the doubt. Yeah. We'll circle him like a pack of dogs and kill him. I could start throwing pyromancy at him, but I'm afraid I'm going to hit my um, partner. Here, I don't want to go. I don't want to circle the same way. Okay. Do not let him drink. Yeah, I'm not doing um, any heroic fair one-on-ones right now. There we go. Sometimes it happens. And a blue titanite chunk. Awesome. So hey, we got to end this series on kind of a high note. It was two-on-one, but <laughs> I'll take whatever victory we can get for the forest hunters here. And let me quickly t um, take this ring off. Because I, um, want to first check out, where is it? The ring we got from Sif, which is the Hornet Ring, boosts critical attacks. One of the special rings granted to the four knights of Gwyn. The Hornet Ring belonged to the Lord's Blade, Syrian. By boosting critical attacks, its wearer can annihilate foes. 
the Syrian's dagger did something to fuck you, you stupid cauliflower head. Awesome. Okay. I, I gotta finish that. I gotta know what it actually said. By boosting critical attacks, its wire can annihilate foes as Syrian's dagger laid waste to Lord Gwen's enemies. Awesome. Um, I'm just gonna leave that ring on for now because I don't want to do a whole bunch of PvP uh, off-screen. I might, though. I might get into a few fights and kind of uh, continue to warm up a bit. But, for the foreseeable future, for at least the next probably two or three videos, this is what I'm going to be doing. We're going to be doing PvP here, running through the forest. I might try to tackle Sif a few more times. Eventually, I'm going to kill him. I have no doubt in my mind that I can, that I can take him down uh, if I just play a little bit smarter and quit trying to be a, such an idiot. And we got a blue Titanite chunk, which is actually pretty rare because I've only got one of those before. Reinforces magic weapons to plus nine and enchanted to plus four. Awesome. So whenever we come back, more forest hunting.